So next week for Modern Warfare Tuesday seems like it might be a pretty interesting day here. We have some new Season 2 content coming and then also the potential for something happening with Warzone Modern Warfare's Battle Royale. So first, along with the Season 2 content, we have some new stuff coming from the roadmap. What's coming next week? So we've got some 3v3 snipers on Rust Action coming your way along with Infantry Ground War, a tweak on regular Ground War where there's no tanks and APC Seas. We're also adding a new map bazaar into the rotation and to make the weekend even better We'll be turning on double XP starting Friday So this was the community update last week But obviously we're focusing on the content from the season 2 roadmap that we're going to be getting throughout season 2 And we're already getting a new map bazaar. I'll show you guys some images of the map up on screen It's a pretty cool map. It's obviously a gunfight map originally supposed to be launching with season 2 on its launch day back on February 11th but didn't happen we're getting it now next week obviously on tuesday for the next update so that's pretty cool to see and hopefully it is a solid gunfight map being added to the rotation personally i still think we need some more 6v6 map rust was definitely a good addition to the game atlas superstore i don't know it's decent let me know down below what you guys think about those two maps so far but i think overall we still need more 6v6 maps bizarre as a gunfight map that's cool but i would like to see them put more effort into 6v6 6v6 maps, especially for season three. We only really got three 6v6 maps in total for season two. It should really be five, especially if you're they're doing more content and they're putting more emphasis on the actual long-term goals of Modern Warfare. If they want to keep those long-term goals and make people continue to play the game and support the battle pass and do all this different stuff, you're going to need more solid 6v6 maps because that's really the core of Modern Warfare. So some other content as well, the Ground War game mode, it's Ground War without tanks and all that different stuff. I mean, that's probably going to be really fun because definitely I don't play ground war too much but I'm always dying to tanks and I don't know about you guys I'd rather just play straight ground war a bunch of people shooting at each other I feel like that would be really fun and if I want to add some tank action in, I'll go over to the other ground war game mode so we'll see how well that plays also Tuesday again is the date we've been talking about I'm, I'm not making this a full-on warzone video but I do want to add this because now the modern warzone account is tweeting again specifying that he's really feeling that the media embargo will be lifted on that day obviously he talked about the three different options and they're pretty basic options here one the game actually fully releases or the game mode warzone fully releases on tuesday february 25th like i said that's not really going to happen there's no way that's going to happen at this point all the evidence is for a release in early march march 3rd or march 10th two was the media embargo being lifted and then the third option wasn't really for Tuesday, but it was them doing a live release at PAX East on Thursday when PAX East actually starts. But regardless of that, I think the media embargo is still something we're looking at here because we know they went out to record the game a few days ago before the weekend started. We know that Warzone gameplay is going to be coming. We just don't know exactly when. If they're doing a March 3rd release, Tuesday, this Tuesday would be a day in which we see something like that. The new update comes out, some new season two content, and also at the same time, 1 p.m. Eastern Time, 10 a.m. Pacific Time on Tuesday, we also get some new gameplay being released on these YouTube channels. Now, I've been thinking about what the streamers are going to be doing because obviously there were streamers invited out, Dr. Disrespect, Shroud, a bunch of those guys were definitely at this Warzone event. So I'm wondering how that's going to work, whether or not there's going to be a specific streamer event, whether or not they're going to release the game mode and then allow the streamers to stream it early somehow. I mean, something like that because, you know, really them recording gameplay doesn't really make sense because they're streamers their entertainment comes from the actual stream the ongoing stream itself so we'll see how that works but i think for now definitely the youtubers that recorded gameplay early if the media embargo is lifted this tuesday will be able to release that gameplay let me know down below what you guys think about this warzone releasing when do you guys think um the game modes as well ground war should be pretty fun the new map hopefully that's good as well and then we're still waiting for that last 6v6 map which we'll probably get very soon I think maybe they'll either throw that in before Warzone releases or after. It depends on when Warzone releases. Like if Warzone releases earlier than expected, that last 6v6 map a part of Season 2 will come later and then vice versa. Warzone releases later, maybe the third week of March, we'll see that last 6v6 map the first week of March. So that's pretty much how it's going to work. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys later.